Patricia Gracia, business owner and CEO of the Power Woman Business Center. She has her own advertising agency, very successful, by the way. And, uh, you know, I'm blessed to share this space with you. Thank you. Thank you, Paxi. Yes, uh, a successful woman. Thank you for the description. Thank you for the nice introduction. Uh, Power Media Group, the advertising agency. Uh, I know how hard it is to start a business. Like I said, I always is, I always mentioned that I, I, I was uh, blessed to start my business from home with a fax machine and a, a, a copy machine and a telephone and just the enthusiastic right after I graduated from UCLA in public relations. And then I decided to start my ad, my ad agency by myself. That was in 2001. Seven years after, we were able to buy a beautiful facility, a commercial building in Santa Clarita uh, because when you have a dream and when you have a vision, Vision and dreams can be accomplished by yourself and by the help of others. Uh, and you always have to say thank you. And you know, don't let anyone or anything to stop you. To stop you and steal your dreams. Because if somebody comes to your mind and tell you, no, you cannot do it. No. And then they do it. This is impossible. <laughs> it's a, it's when, we just, when we decided to buy a building here, and that was back in 2008, the recession time was the worst recession time in the whole history of the United States. And I had many people telling me, you know what, don't even apply. They're not going to look at you. you. Do you think any banks are going to lend you money to buy a building? And I say, you know what, that's the reason why I'm applying, because so many people think like you. So you got to be different. And that's the reason why I want to interview Patsy Ayala, obviously representing Howard Valley's magazine this time. You've been always representing other people, oh, the Power Women's Business Center, the Power Media Group, the Latino Chamber, but you've never been representing yourself, Patsy. So this segment is going to be just for you, Patsy Ayala, Julio Del Rio, which is your partner, your husband, and I really admire you because you guys work really hard. I'm seeing you from the beginning, and I'm seeing you how hard you were um, in the in the past uh, uh, year or so. You have Bill Miranda joined Our Valley's magazine, but uh, let's talk from the beginning. How did you come up with the idea of having Our Valley's magazine? You know, before I was working for General Electric Aircraft Engines and Power Systems Division, and I was doing the corporate communication. Before that, I was working for TV Azteca, the big, uh, one of the biggest TV companies in Mexico. And here in the United States. And Yeah, yes. they're here in the United States. Yes, here. Oh, here is big too, and for the Latino market. And I was doing also corporate communication, human resources, training, marketing, uh, you know, <laughs> but why a magazine? Why a magazine? Exactly, because there, uh, in those two companies, there was a magazine. Oh, okay. And I was involved in that. And also one time traveling to my country, Mexico, that's where I am. Uh, I was born in Mexico City. Um, I noticed in Idaho, Mexico, they have this bilingual magazine. And I love the quality, the images, the message. And I was like, you know, that would be nice to bring these to the city I live. And that's why we started that. And we started as with a magazine. And we did our marketing study. We prepared ourselves, our business plan, everything. We went to Power Woman Business Center. We also went to the SBDC. We wanted to get all the advice and counseling possible to start a successful business here. So you find out that it was a need in here in our community that we really need a bilingual magazine. Yes. A, a, a magazine that it will have an impact for our business owner and not only the business owners, exactly. the, com the community and the community and the consumers as well. So then you become really successful. Briefly, I'm going to say that you become really successful after a couple of years running the magazine, seeing you all over, Patsy, I'm seeing you all over, working hard because that's the most important. Not just having a dream and be a business owner, work hard. And be you know, involved, and giving to the community. We evolve, we evolve. Not a magazine anymore. Now we offer social media campaigns. We are on the internet. Now we are sharing. Online marketing, online marketing. Online marketing. And we have the digital magazine. Uh, we promote uh, with networking. I'm your uh, mobile uh, billboard. Your mobile billboard, <laughs> and not only a mobile, uh, somebody that is trustworthy, somebody that has integrity to war, and, ju just, and just to close down, somebody that I've been working in the past few years, and I feel an honor to be with you, Patsy. I wish you the best. I know that our valleys is not going to be succeeding in this valley. It's going to go 
all over the valleys. I mentioned you before, since we started the magazine, well, you started, but I told you the vision is that our valleys is going to stay here in the city of Santa Clarita, but you're going to start moving forward to other valleys because it's going to be our valleys. Yeah, but other valleys. Thank you so much, and I wish you the best. Thank and you. we're leaving. The time is so short. And don't forget that this show is being brought to you by the Power Women's Business Center, a business incubator that is helping you to start your business. And if you already really start your business, you'll see it's 11 o'clock. Business. Come time over for to NBC me. News on your hometown station. K-H-T-S.